Hi, I'm Miranda, and my husband Chris and I have decided to start making videos of our adventures in Belize. So he bought me this GoPro for my birthday, so I thought it was time to start making good use of it. So we started this adventure two years ago, and we really wish we would have started videoing it back then because so much has happened over the last two years and I'll have to catch you guys up on everything that's happened in some other videos but right now um, I'll give you a little background of where we started this adventure. Um, first over 10 years ago I went on a mission trip to Belize and then in the fall of 2019, we went on a cruise with my family and um, Belize was one of the stops. So my husband got to see Belize at that time and he fell in love with it too. So when we were on our way back from Belize and from the cruise we were in the airport and we were already looking at real estate to buy and we got all excited about it and we just continued to look at the real estate online over that next year until we found something that we loved and that was in our price range and so we jumped on it we found an awesome realtor down there and it was during COVID, so we couldn't go to look at property. Um, the country was pretty much shut down. So our realtor went to this house and did a walkthrough video so that we could see everything. And um, we decided that yes, it was for us. And so we bought it. and. It took a few more months before we got to go down there to see it after we bought it, but now we've made four trips to Belize since then, and we are getting ready to make our fifth trip, and I am packing up for that right now. And so I want to start with some of the things that I'm packing to show you guys what we're doing. So we go and we work on our house a lot while we're there because we're kind of fixing it up. And um, so I'll show you guys our first suitcase. So we're taking this belt sander this time because we are going to sand our deck and water seal it. And we also have in here some of the sandpaper to go with it. Um, we are going to pile our bathroom countertops. So we're taking some of our tile stuff that we had already, some of our tile tools, and just so that whenever we get there, we don't have to go looking for them at this hardware store. We'll have all of them. So sometimes it's hard to find what you need when you get there. Um, sometimes you can find what you need, but um, just in case we're taking this stuff. Um, we've taken other stuff in the past and um and left it there we've taken like hammocks and stuff like that and whenever we go through customs we always put those things on our customs forms and um we go ahead and pay the customs form because we're gonna leave them there but we've been told that we can take our tools and tell them that we're just going to use them in the construction of our house and we're gonna bring them back and not have to take um, pay customs on it. So we'll see how that goes and hopefully we don't have to pay customs. Um, so we, whenever we first moved down there, we discovered that we 
are living, our house is real close to a mission. And we made really good friends with the people there at the mission. And so um, whenever we go, I like to take some things there. And the last time we went to visit, we had some friends of ours, William and Michelle. And Michelle just fell in love with the girls there too. And she makes these beautiful tutus. So after we got back, she said, I'm going to make some of these tutus for these girls and I want you to take them with you when you go next time. And so she sent them to me and I've got those packed. I wanna show you guys these. They are so cute. Michelle has no idea that I'm doing this video. Um, so she made these super cute tutus. Let's see if I can get some good light on them. Look at those super cute colors. And she got the names of all of the girls at the mission and she put names on the tutus for them. And it's so cute. So she has this little small business. It's called Too Much Twirl. And she also makes these um, cute custom vans and other tennis shoes. And they are so cute. So here's her little card. So if you guys have a little girl or a niece or something that you need to buy a gift from, you guys should definitely check out her her online store. She is just a super sweet girl. So this is my other suitcase that I have my personal stuff in. And I just want to show you guys what kinds of things that I pack that I've learned that are great to take to Belize. Some of my tricks. <laughs> so um, I like to put my clothes into these two gallon zipper bags and I like to put a little dryer sheet in there with them because it keeps them fresh and I try to push all the air out and I'm going to put more in this suitcase. This is just what I have so far. Um, so this is something new that I'm taking. It is a Turkish beach towel that is supposed to be super like fast to dry. And we always have a problem with our towels there. Like you use them and they start smelling bad really fast. So we're gonna give this a try. I'll tell you guys how it turns out later if it works really good. Um, so I am taking, when I'm there, I usually wear pants and um, not shorts because it gets, you know what, there's a lot of mosquitoes and I sunburn really easy. So I just kind of like to cover up a lot. I do wear a lot of sunscreen and bug spray while I'm there too, but I'm gonna show you guys the kind the things that I like the most when I go. These are Columbia PFG pants and they are called um, Omni Shade. And they are really lightweight and thin so you don't get too hot when you're in Belize. And I love to wear those all the time when I'm there. These are some like linen beach pants that I just got and I'm going to try these out and see if they are not too hot when we go. I'm hoping they're not. Um, I also like to wear like all dry fit shirts and I have some of these long sleeve Omni Shade Columbia shirts too. Um, to wear 
and then a lot of other just dry fit t-shirts and um i i like to you wear the long sleeve more just to keep covered up and i can always push the sleeves up if i want to but those are kind of some of the favorite things and how i like to dress when i go um i wear um i have some tennis shoes that i left there and some another pair of flip-flops that i've left there and some shorts that i have left there and whenever i go and i travel i only wear a pair of flip-flops i don't take any other shoes with me because i mean that's pretty much all we wear is flip-flops there um but i try to pack pretty minimal now um especially since we've left a lot of stuff there and we don't have to take so much with us anymore um so this is my first video i'm going to post it on youtube try it out see if i can work this thing i've not done this before and then um, we'll see how it goes and then i'll make some more videos next week when we leave for Belize and I'll probably try to start out with the airport so you guys can see um, what it's like as you come into Belize and how to get through customs and and all of that stuff so until then bye